All right, welcome back. As you can see, this isn't the uh, 205 by by any means. We're marking trees, or this should have been done a long time ago, but I'm gonna attempt to mark trees, dead ones, which there's not many leaves on there, but what are we doing with this thing? Well, we got it back. Yeah, I didn't make payments, long story short, we went and got it. Ah, uh, we do have a few guys interested in it, and I haven't operated it much at all. We have had it back for a week, to, as of today. And I took it over here to the pasture, and I'm not gonna get it shitty or anything. I vacuumed it out. Can do a little better job with these foot pedals. We're trying to keep it nice as possible. Well, it's just gonna be a little mud on her. I'm gonna snag a fodder bale since I'm here. But I do miss it. I really do. I wish we could keep it. It breaks my heart. Broke my heart the first time it left, but all right, what a first time it left. At least we still got the 205, that's what I was thinking. Because we were going to keep the 185, which was not two speed, 205 is. So, like, thank God we, we got 205. But I put like three, 400 hours on the 205 this year. And, you know, this is way different trying to back this up, maneuver it, whatever. But, I'm starting to get used to it again. I really, really miss it. Mark my words, someday, someday I will buy either a 650 or a nine, or a 590, sorry. 650 or 590, two speed, Kubota engine, air ride seat. This one is a little bit of a diesel pig, but it is a powerhouse. Takes a lot of fuel to turn it. Oh, how do you open these? There we go. All right, so she looks like on the inside, nothing pretty by any means. She gets the job done. I really want one of these ponies. We got this first year they started making them. We were the first one in the, the few our county and a few counties surrounding us to get one of these one of these guys, one of these fucking beasts. We had it for on the trailer for hauling hay, which that put quite a bit of weight in the trailer. Uh, but once we got the 205 two speed, just use that a lot less fuel, unload semis quicker. I believe my dad did it in one night. Just unloaded the semi and set it in the shed real quick in like six minutes or something like that. With all the guy, the guy all the straps off, and he used to bet truckers how much you want to bet I can load this under 10 minutes, you know, 20 bucks, you know, something like that. And no one could believe that he can load it that quick. He can load it quick with this thing too, but it takes more power to turn it and you can't do it quite as quick. But this is, if we kept this, I'd always have this in the field. You know, we can go maybe a mile an hour quicker, maybe two mile an hour quicker than the 205. And you're gonna need the extra weight in the field, you know, carrying two or three bales on your, on your hay fork like a rafter wrecker going through the field really quick you're gonna need the extra weight in the back so you don't you know tip forward anyways it's enough of me rambling i'm either someday for the next five to ten years 590 or 650 gotta have Kubota. gotta have you know air condition you know everything they gotta have everything anyways that's it